Hello, my name is Tanya, I'm a web developer and in this video I'm going to talk about comparison. We compare files, folders, branches a lot in our work and have great tool to do this, could save a lot of our time. So currently I'm working on Python and I'm using PyCharm uh, and also I use Git and GitHub. And first feature that I would like to show you uh, is local history in PyCharm. So we could choose folder or files and uh, click local history and show history. And PyCharm actually track all changes in our files. You could see here, you could roll back if you need. And uh, before PyCharm, I used another editor uh, without this feature. And I had a situation when I just removed my code to test something, forget about that. And the next day when I opened my project and I like, where is my code? And uh, it was very frustrated. And in that moment, I just hate the whole world. Uh, because I need to write this again. So don't hate the word, just use editor with local history. Uh, next uh, very useful feature uh, in PyCharm, it uh, gives you ability to compare two files or two folder. So we just selecting two files and clicking compare two files. Yeah, this particular two files, uh, there is no big sense to compare it, but still I think you got the idea. Or for example, you are working on two projects and you have similar files, similar folders in this project, uh, projects and from time to time you need to compare it. So you could click on folder and compare directory with and you choosing the folder in for another project or in this project and you see all differences between all files in this project. It could be very, very useful. The same thing is with our remote server. We also could compare uh, files and synchronize it. So you just click deployment and synchronize with deployment. And uh, again, our great div tool is here. Uh, next, uh, next, when we're using uh, version control system and when we are going to add new commit, what we will have? Yes, again, we will have our div tool. And uh, I think you noticed that uh, this div tool looks the same and this is great because you just will have the habit to <laughs> to see this uh, window and after some time it will be very easy for you to understand what is going on here but it it already were uh, very intuitive and easy but after some time uh, I actually just cannot live without this feature and I'm not a big fan uh, of uh, command line and I actually don't like this div tool in Git because I think uh, having, uh, 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 having this uh, feature in PyCharm when I see all my code, yeah, uh, it's... Uh, <laughs> it's uh, much easier uh, to keep your code with less bugs. So this is, uh, this is my opinion. Uh, next uh, thing that PyCharm could also help you uh, to compare branches. We could do this for whole repo and again for uh, folders, files. So we just uh, choosing Git 
and compare with branch and here is all our branch we could also for example now we are in master branch and we could compare this branch with remote master i will choose this one and here you see all files that were changed and i'm clicking on this one and i see the changes yep by the way, you, uh, you saw that um, we have here these spaces differences, but uh, you, get, uh, you can uh, add settings to your part charm, so uh, it will not count this as differences. Um, as I said before, we also could compare uh, files and actually we could compare some area in this file for, with another branches so we are selecting this area uh, we click in git and show history for selection pycharm need uh, a little time because this wrapper is very big this is bootstrap wrapper and uh, he just searched, searching searching for all, all commits and we will see that uh, this area was changed twice and this we see the differences and this is very cool i lose, use it a lot because uh, when actually when you pull a new branch yeah and you see new code and you often think hmm uh, who actually adds these changes? So who I'm um, going to blame for these changes? <laughs> Joking. So um, I just see, okay, this developer adds this, this developer changes that. So great feature, very useful. Uh, I'm still going to go to GitHub. And uh, GitHub also have this div tool and uh, uh, I think it also very great so let's look at this uh, the first uh, thing where you're going to see this this is of course in our commits so let's click on any commit and we have here div tool uh, last month um, github added the new mod for uh, this uh, tool this is split one and it looks uh, very much the same as in PyCharm and when I read the, this news in GitHub blog I was very excited because I always thought that such uh, visualization as I said before is much more intuitive. Uh, it works very very good now but i still i still think uh, it could be uh, it could be work even better and i truly believe github will do this better uh, so uh, next uh, next we could of course comparing our branches to do it easy we could use pull request create pull request we choosing two branches and voila we see all differences um, as you see here in our url we actually see that we are comparing now master and this fix branch and uh, if you just need to send some link uh, some developer with uh, with these differences with these changes you don't need to actually create pull request because uh, you just could send this link and this is very cool and the same you could do with uh, commits so um, for example here we have our commits and uh, we just uh, copying commit search commit sha and let's do next here will be our commit and here we will have head commit and we will see all differences between these two particular uh, commits well i think uh, this is it uh, and um, yeah um, i hope it was 
interesting for you and the next time when you will think hmm, what was the difference in that branch or in that files uh, don't think about that use uh, diff tools because we have so great tools from idea and from uh, github so good luck and uh, thank you